Hey, Dark Ops all here for Doc Sports, and today is April the 2nd. We are back with more free picks for you. Had a winner yesterday. Actually, I had two winners for you yesterday in free picks. The uh, had the right total with the amazing system that I had to give, give out to you, so that was a good one. And the West Coast Wise Guys came through. I think I saw a question about West Coast Wise Guys, so I'll just try and explain it real quick. What this is? What this is? It's a group of guys that I was um, oh, that contacted me years ago. They're thinking about doing a website at the time with what they had. Variety of different guys uh, all over the all over the country, really. Uh, primarily the ones that were on the West Coast, so that the name we came up with at the time. But it's just it's sharing uh, best bets and some and other plays amongst the group. It's loosely anywhere from 25 to 40 people at, at, at any given time, just depending who knows who or whatever it is. So that's what it is. And so what I do each and every day is uh, whoever been the best guy in terms of the more recent record, because I go through and I grade the plays. Um, and so who's ever been like the hottest person, that's the picks I give out, okay, on the on that. So it rotates when they lose. I rotate them out, okay, and stuff like that. So that's exactly how it works. So nothing nothing huge, nothing big or anything like that, but that's the name that goes back uh, quite a while. And so I just have just kept it that way. So hopefully that explains that. So let's explain hopefully some more winners today, okay? Uh, I'm going to pass on the NBA, but I had another winner. 41 and 14. And so just phenomenal run in the NBA. Just even, even I'm kind of speechless about it, to be perfectly honest, to, to go on that kind of a run. But so passing today, uh, by the way, it was Washington plus the nine, and they won by what, 32 or three outright over Dallas last night. So just, just nuts. I, you know, I'm humbled by it, to be perfectly honest. So what do I got going today? I, what I have, I got my, I have one play. Uh, in in basketball, that's from the final four. So I got my top play of the final four, and I have just one going today because the other one's going to be about the uh, my free pick. So can't can't do both of those right. Well, I could do both, but hey, so I'm doing that. Uh, so I got to play. That's thirty bucks at the Dugout Zone page at Doc Sports, along with my favorite favorite in the NHL. I've hit eight of my last thirteen in the NHL. A nice starting to get a little momentum, a little setback yesterday, but you know, get that turned around. And today, horse racing. Okay, I know not everybody bets the horses, but I tell you what, I got a deal that is is tight. Uh, so one thing is kind of so we're talking about big races. We're talking about well, it's five weeks to the Kentucky Derby. So we're talking the Florida Derby today. We're talking the Arkansas Derby today, uh, all, and then the um, Jeff Ruby Stakes Stakes. Okay, they're spelled differently. Stakes as in eat and stakes as in horse racing in this case. So I got all three of those races, a total of 10 selections for you for just $25, 10 different picks over the three races. Okay, you can pick that up at my page for just 25 bucks at the Dog Up Zone page at Doc Sports. For those who don't recall from last year, last year I had each triple crown Winner triple. I'm sorry. I, I won money and bets on and profited in each triple crown race. Get that clear, okay? Just across the board. So had a great year last year. Going to look to duplicate that, and this is all part of the process because the winners of these are probably even the top two uh, will probably end up qualifying or being close to qualifying for the Kentucky Derby in five weeks. So consider that. So they're all big races today. That's my point. So again, ten picks, ten bets. Just $25 today. Let's get to today's free play. All right. Uh, I'm going to go against the grain. I've been doing that a little bit lately, so why not keep it going? I've had success. And the highly anticipated matchup between North Carolina and Duke, everybody's going to want to see this one. Be the drama, not only because of who these two teams are, their history, everything else, we got the Coach K saga going on. What what the happened there? Does North Carolina uh, deprive them again? They deprive them of um, well, they deprive them of Coach K winning his final home game in Durham. So that's so there's there's I mean there's a million storylines okay on this one, and I I know that a popular play is going to be on the over, and why wouldn't it be? They've played six straight overs, these two teams, and the closing lines this year were 152 and a half and 153, and they went both and they went over on both those. However, I, I don't know, maybe just I'm looking for something. I, I could certainly be wrong. I'm not going to deny that. But I'm looking at the opening total, which was 150 and a half. 
Okay, and this one, which is lower. So both of them went over, but then they're bringing out a, a, a total that's that's even lower. The odds makers are. So I guess I'm kind of thinking, well, the odds makers are looking at the gravity of the situation for both teams. It's, obviously, it's a Final Four game. They're playing each other. Everything, you know, there's the familiarity aspect of that. Uh, so maybe they're thinking, which I can't disagree with, is that both teams will be a little bit too geeked up to play. I'm not going to say nervous. I just think nervous energy, maybe. And I might be a little bit too geeked up to play and miss some shots, particularly in the first, let's just say, five to seven minutes of the game. Now, if they shoot 60% thereafter, it doesn't make any difference. But if, if they play a normal game, but they go low scoring the first five or seven minutes, that could alter what the total could look like in this one. Uh, since the opening number was released, uh, it has climbed to 152.5 as I do this video. And you know me, well, you do, if you've been watching these videos, I'm always on the look for uncovering gems. And the last eight times there has been a Final Four game in which the the, the total has moved at least one point on the close, uh, from the opening line to the closing line. And as we do this video, I don't know what the closing line is going to be, but it right now it's two points higher th than what it was. The, the direction of the line move has been wrong seven of the last eight times in the final four. So what am I going to do? You got it. I'm taking the under 152 and a half between North Carolina and Duke today in the final four. Again, thank you for watching the videos. Okay, great numbers, especially a lot of people came in late and after the, after the game had already started and checked out yesterday's video. So that was crazy, at least to me it was, uh, and checked it out. I mean, that's I'm not saying that's not, a, not uh, uncommon, but that was a large number of people that came in and did that yesterday. So that was interesting. And so I thank you for watching that. And if you haven't subscribed to the Doc channel, please do so. Not only get my videos, but you get the videos of all the guys that are putting, putting them out at Doc's. On there, uh, and also today, if you've never signed up for uh, free plays or for yeah for free play action, well, if you're interested in horse racing, if you're interested today in the um, uh, final four or also in hockey, you can sign up for sixty dollars worth of free plays by signing up. Go to my page and look for the box in the upper left hand corner. Fill that baby out right there, and you are on your way to free picks. Or if you'd rather wait, say say you want to try out some horse racing today, and you'd rather wait till tomorrow to see my NBA play. And I will have an NBA play tomorrow. You can check that out and you can get both of those. Whatever works best for you. That's what my interests are as far as that goes. So uh, make sure to check that out as well. So today, horse racing, 10 bets, 25 bucks, major races across the board. Uh, my final four pick, just one. And the uh, NHL favorite, favorite, all available at the Dugups on page at Doc Sports. The West Coast Wise guys play for today is take the Miami Heat against the Chicago Bulls, I think, Saturday night on that one. So this is Doug Upton for Doc Sports. I'll be back tomorrow with more free play action. Until next time, I'm out.